from cabinet doors to coffee tables, just about every woodworking project is going to start by gluing up a wide panel out of individual sections. But have you noticed that no matter how carefully you joint and plane your stock, there always seems to be a little bit of bow, twist, or cup left when it's time to glue your panel up. Applying vertical pressure to the sections helps, but it's really easy to glue your clamps or clamping calls to your project. Woodpecker's new joint bridges bridge over the seam and the glue. Just place one joint bridge under the joint, one on top of the joint, and clamp them together. Any misalignment between the two sections is flattened out, and your lateral clamps can pull the joint together flat and square. And each pair of joint bridges focuses on just one joint line, rather than averaging pressure over the whole panel. If you're working on a longer panel and you need to level the boards in the middle, just use scrap stock above and below the joint bridges to apply pressure to all of them at once. Gluing up through inlaid cutting boards involves inlay strips that have to be thicker than the board. Joint bridges simplify the process and help keep the boards flat too. If you have older clamps with small cast iron pads, Joint bridges can distribute the clamping pressure over a larger area and decrease damage to your material. Joint bridges come in 12 packs and 24 packs. They're going to make your panels flatter and easier to finish while expanding what you can do in your shop. Order yours today.